Hey friends, let's get cooking today. Um, today I'm going to make ham and taschen. I'm probably not saying it correctly, but it's a uh, pastry cookie and it's often served during Purim and it's kind of a uh, little treat that's given out to everybody. It's like a peace offering. And it's basically in shape of a beggar's hat or a thief's hat, I meant the triangular hat. So these are going to be little triangle shortbread cookies with jam and them. So first we're gonna start with two and a quarter cups of all-purpose flour. To that, we're gonna add one cup of powdered sugar. And then what I'm gonna do is pulse this a few times in my food processor. Okay, we're just looking to fully incorporate the sugar, the flour. Also, I added one teaspoon of salt. So now we're just gonna start adding butter. I have some cold, cold butter here. I'm gonna add two sticks. In the same concept, we're just gonna pulse the dough. We're looking for it to come together kind of like wet sand or little peas. couple tips are you don't want to uh, overwork the dough and you definitely want to let the dough rest for about 30 to 30 minutes to an hour let the dough rest before you roll it out that way the gluten relaxes and they are not tough Okay, so the dough is starting to look good. It's kind of like wet sand right now. So next we're gonna add two yolks. So this enriches the dough, makes it enriched, and also it's gonna give it a nice yellow color. And to that we're gonna add probably two tablespoons of uh, cold water. Ice water works really good, so. Make a little mess here. It's a little fuller in the mixer than I thought it would be. So the dough is still a little dry. It's easier to add more water than to add too much and then have to redo it completely. Now the dough is starting to come together really nicely. This is what we're looking for here. Still check it, it's a little bit dry, but we're very, very close. So that was probably two tablespoons. I'm gonna add another one, go out to say at least three tablespoons of water. Perfect. So now it just forms into a gentle dough or a soft dough, and that's exactly what we're looking for. Okay. 
I'm not going to need this though or anything because you don't need to. It's already fully incorporated, but I will kind of make it into a nice ball shape. And there's our dough. And thank you for joining me. We'll come back in about half an hour. We'll roll out these lovely little cookies and bake them off and enjoy them. Thank you.